Hey everybody, welcome to Real Estate Happens. I'm John McQuilkin. Thanks for tuning in. Today I am showing houses in a town called Lancaster, California, which is within Los Angeles County. And I thought I'd show you a very beautiful neighborhood here in Lancaster. This is um, Low Tree Avenue, and I'm on Norbury Street. I'm gonna turn on to Low Tree Avenue and show you these beautiful ranch style houses. Lancaster sometimes gets a bad rap. People think that there aren't, you know, really nice neighborhoods in Lancaster, and they are so wrong. There's just beautiful homes here in Lancaster. Most all the homes in this neighborhood are one-story ranch homes. Now, the advantage of having a one-story home is you don't have neighbors from a second floor peering down into your backyard. So if you're relaxing by the pool, you have complete privacy. This is my favorite home in the entire neighborhood. It is a beautiful brick home, very low maintenance. Just a beautiful sprawling ranch house. Look at that beautiful porch. Can you just picture yourself relaxing on that porch swing? I know I certainly can. Just a magnificent neighborhood. Now I'm gonna turn the camera around because I want you to see this house. This home is a custom-made house. It's uh, like Regency style. We have a lot of these homes in Beverly Hills, but this is a custom-built, the same owner. Just a beautiful house, very large. Now I'm gonna drive through the neighborhood and show you some more of the houses. Now again, most of these are all one-story ranch. There are some two-story homes in the neighborhood, but one-story are my favorite, especially once you start getting older. Who wants to be going up and down steps once you're older? Okay, so just gonna drive through, just beautiful landscaping. Now, these homes, they did a little Christmas design there. These homes rarely come on the market. And when they do come on the market, family members end up buying them so they can live close to their other family members. So it's one of those coveted neighborhoods, just a hidden gem of a neighborhood in the city of Lancaster. I'm gonna try to swing the camera back around. I'm trying to move the camera slowly because I hate it when people jerk the camera really fast. Let me move it back here again. I'm going a little too fast, but I like this house. Very low maintenance, nice trees, because it does get uh, hot in Lancaster. Now here is one of the two-story houses. There are like two two-story houses in the whole neighborhood. And actually there's a couple more up ahead, but these are more newer homes, the, one I'm about, the ones I'm about to show you. All the rest were built in the 50s, 60s, and 70s. This one's a more modern home. And then we have another modern home right there. And then this is one of the original homes in the neighborhood. And now I'm going to just turn around and drive back through one more time. God, I just love this house. Just complete privacy. It's at the end of a cul-de-sac. If you have kids, they can play out in the street. You don't have to worry about them. Okay. So, here we go. Here's that more modern two-story house I told you about. It's in Mediterranean Spanish-style design. It's a beautiful house. But it doesn't fit in with the rest of the homes in the neighborhood. Like I said, all the rest are ranch style houses. Okay, I'm just driving through one more time through the neighborhood. Again, this is Lancaster, California. You can sometimes get a deal in this neighborhood at around $400,000. Which may seem like a lot depending on what area you are watching this video in, but for Los Angeles to get a home this big, that's pretty amazing. Because these homes in Lancaster are in the Antelope Valley, and that is 
why they're a little bit less expensive. I'm gonna let this car go around. Okay. The Antelope, Val the Antelope Valley is part of Los Angeles County, but there are much more affordable homes in the Antelope Valley. In Los Angeles, the city of Los Angeles, homes of this size would go for a minimum of eight to nine hundred thousand dollars on up. Yeah, I know. I know that's crazy, especially if you're watching this in a part of the country where a home like this would only sell for around two hundred and fifty thousand. But you're paying for the neighborhood, for the area, and Los Angeles is just an expensive place to live. But the wages are higher, they pay you more money. So this neighborhood is only two streets long. So this is it. I'm gonna swing the camera back around. Big sprawling ranch style houses. And we're almost done with this neighborhood, but I just wanted to show you, cause like I said, it's only two streets. So just bear with me while we drive through. Okay. I love that style window in a ranch house. Those were the original type of windows in ranch houses. They're called diamond ranch windows. Well, it, the window's called the diamond pane window. But houses that have that type of window, sometimes they call it a diamond, a diamond ranch or diamond pane ranch. What a peaceful, beautiful house. And then I'm gonna swing the camera around and show you the house on the other side of the street. Not much to see, but it's low maintenance. It's all brick, a big, large yard. Just a very nice house. And then we have another house here. Look at that sprawling ranch house. Couldn't you just picture yourself pulling into that circular driveway? I know I could. And here we go. This home has recently um, been fixed up and now they're flipping it. It was for sale, if I recall, for around 399,000. And now they've completely, you know, fixed up, remodeled it, and it's for sale again. Well, that completes this tour. Let me flip the camera around one more time so you can see this house here. Nice home, three car garage. This is a newer house though, but at least they built it to fit in with the rest of the neighborhood. So there you have it. This is Lancaster, California, one of those hidden gem of the neighborhoods in Lancaster, California. I hope you enjoyed this video. If there's anything I can do for you regarding real estate or anything else in the world, please don't hesitate to ask. I'm John McQuilkin and I'll see you in real estate.